Hey fellow developers, welcome back to our channel. Today we have got something really exciting for you. Today we have got something really exciting for all of you night owls and dark theme lovers. We are going to take a deep dive into how to implement dark mode using Tailwind CSS. So say goodbye to Ice Train and dazzle your users with an aesthetic dark mode that's all the rage these days. Ready? Let's get coding. So dark mode is not a trend. It's a user friendly feature that can save battery life on OLED screens and provide a more comfortable viewing experience. To follow along, you will need a basic understanding of HTML and CSS. You need Tailwind CSS installed in your project. I already have covered in one of my YouTube videos that how to install Tailwind CSS you, so you can simply go there and follow it and install it for, for yourself. Right now I already have the Tailwind CSS installed and ready and working in my editor. It is running in my browser as well. So I will start with this code in the Tailwind CSS. It is really and incredibly easy. Here right now you can see we just have hello world text here and also simple HTML. I will start adding some class to the body for that add class and I will add BG white and dark BG black. So this will uh, set the background color white by default but if it is dark mode then it will set the background color black. Similarly for the text we will add text black by default text would be black but if dark mode is on then text would be white and I will remove the text color from here so that it could pick up from the parent so right now you can see that it is using the black color because of the dark mode so right now dark mode is on for me Now you can see that I have turned off the dark mode and uh, it has started to use the styles that are supposed to be enabled for the light mode. So you can add a lot of other uh, conditions as well based on the dark mode. So for example, let's suppose uh, you want to align everything in the middle if uh, dark mode is enabled, you can set that dark uh, text center so if dark mode is enabled it will uh, align the text in the middle so you can set change dark mode and you can see as soon as dark mode is enabled it has aligned the text in the middle for you so you can do anything whatever you want to do you can do a lot of creative things with it so here we have added classes to change the background and text color based on the dark class in the html tag so right now Tailwind CSS is using the theme from the system. So whatever the theme your system is using, it will, it will be using that theme. So if your system is using dark mode, it will be using that one. But in some cases, you really want to override that behavior. You want to be able to control the dark mode theme with the help of a button, with the help of a toggle button. For that, I will show you how to do that as well. For that, first of all, you need to add a button and add some text, toggle. And now I will give it an ID. After that, I will add a script tag. And in that tag, I will add the constant button is equal to document dot query selector toggle. Now I will register a click event on this button for that type button dot add event listener. And the name of the event would be click. And we will call a callback function when somebody clicks on that. And then we will get the document dot document element dot class list dot toggle and here i will give it the class that i want to add so whenever user will click on that it will add class and it will uh, remove that class so let me show you if it is adding the class or not so here you can see i added a class by clicking on the button the class has been added if you click on that again the class would be removed but the theme is not being changed the reason is that by default it would be preferring the theme from the system or from your operating system but if you want to override that behavior you have to add a little bit configuration in your tailwind config file here you need to add another property in this configuration that is dark mode and here you can see we have two options so by default it uses the media but we are want to uh, we are going to prefer the class mode for the dark mode okay save it 
now you can see as soon as i clicked on that uh, it is now using the class mode for the dark theme so i added this alignment text for the dark mode i will remove it and you can see it is working perfectly fine so it is not now uh, using the system theme preference but it is using the class and that's it dark mode in tailwind css is elegant user friendly and incredibly easy to implement if you found this video helpful then give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more coding magic see you in the next video happy coding